Hi, Jeff Big Daddy Wayne here. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Big Daddy Knows. But today I want to talk to you because you may become a subscriber because I'm going to talk about why we need Houdini now. If you don't know Houdini, just, I don't want you as a subscriber. Houdini is not only one of the most famous people of all times, he's one of the most interesting people of all times, and everybody should know Harry Houdini. That fabulous mu magician that inspired so many people into magic. His fabulous feats. His mystery. Why do we need Houdini now? And why do I have these two bottles of vodka? Well, besides being a functional alcoholic, I, I have them for a reason. Here is why we need Harry Houdini now. Houdini did this fantastic escape once where he dropped from a bridge into the river through a cut hole of ice. And what Houdini would do is he had incredible breath control his surface and there's a thin layer of oxygen, air, between the ice and the river. And he could breathe that in and look for the hole in the ice and then surface through that hole and everybody would go crazy and applaud him. He did it many, many times. All he had to do to look for the hole is see the sunlight streaming. The, the light would uh, shine down there in the water as he swam. Man was in incredible physical condition, physical mental condition, incredible stamina, and brave, a lot of courage. So uh, Houdini, one time, is dropped from the bridge, falls, what, 100 feet through this hole in the water, but the current was stronger than he imagined or planned for, and he couldn't find the hole to come out of. He kept surfacing and getting that little bit of air between the ice and the water. And he heard his mother's voice direct him to the hole in the water. Houdini swore he heard his mother's voice. That convinced Houdini that there is an afterlife. That there is beyond us another world. Mission is possible. So Houdini began a quest going to all these psychics and mind readers and people that said they could contact those that have passed on. Here's what makes Houdini interesting to me. He was looking for someone that's real. He wasn't going out to disprove people. He was going out to prove people that it could be done because he heard it himself. Now you're asking Jeff. Why are you bringing this up now? Well, there's a very important point, and you're asking, why do I have two vodka bottles? I will tell you at the end of this particular video. As Houdini searched and searched and searched for a real medium, a real psychic, all he found was fraud, fraud, fraud. And is there anything more horrible, ladies and gentlemen, than a fraud, especially when you're dealing with the dearly departed people who loved humans, and now they're just trying to have some contact like the movie Nightmare Alley, where Jerome Power is Stanton Carlyle, the great fraud breaking people's hearts about contacting the dead. A film that I believe will be remade with Leonardo DiCaprio, which that would really break your heart. Imagine coming back from the dead and Leo's there, especially if you're on the Titanic. So here's the deal. Why do we need Harry Houdini now? I shall tell you. Have you been watching the Travel Channel lately and a few other ones? There's all these shows about people contacting ghosts, in contact with ghosts. And these shows have accelerated where people go, uh, do you see shadows, moving shadows? Do you hear noises? Is there a feeling there? Uh, did it touch you? And people claim they've been touched, they've been scratched, they've been beaten, they've been pushed. And the beginning of these shows, it was just like a feeling, maybe a voice. But now it's accelerated. There's shadows all over the place. They're being punched, beaten, even sex, sex with ghosts. I did a video on it. Check it out, ladies and gentlemen. Imagine being molested by a ghost. How do you sue them? Uh, the previous people that own this house, I have to sue them. They didn't tell me there was a ghost molesting people in it. How do you prove it? Is that eclectoplasm, that white substance? I don't know. This is why we need a Harry Houdini today. I have a small window for the paranormal. Sometimes it may be real. But we need Harry Houdini to go on each one of these shows and talk to each one of these people that are gripped by the ghost. 
If you watch me, all those people should get an Academy Award, an Emmy, a Tony. Because nobody are, there's no better actors than these people. And they go, I feel something, something's happening. Has it touched you? And that one where they do the sketch, let's have a sketch and it's sealed up. The lady is, that the people who have never seen, the, call me a cynic. I think it's good to question things. So, if there's another Harry Houdini out there, dedicate yourself to flushing them out like a giant turd. Now you ask, Jeff, why do you have two vodka bottles? Well, like everybody, I myself am interested in magic and have tried a couple of tricks. But I found out the real magic in my life is making one of these bottles disappear. I started with the little tricks. I moved on to the big one. That's magic. Happy magic. Big Daddy, Jeff Wayne, subscribe to Big Daddy Knows.